Tonight on Big Brother, Jamie plays the tough guy. Anyone want to piss me off and we'll have, we'll have it out? Camilla, let's fly. I can count that many housemates who felt the exact same way that I did about the issue, but wouldn't have the balls to come to you and say it to your face. And Big Brother makes grown men cry. I think it was about time some guys went. Yeah, I, if all the girls kept going, we have none left. That's no fun. It's nominations day, and after being up for eviction five times, Camilla is keen on a week off. Be interesting to see what happens tonight. Oh, I just know I'll be up again. I don't really care. It's just frustrating because now instead of people, like, I don't know, people don't even come up to me anymore and go, are you all right or anything? They just go, ah, oh, you'll be fine. And it's like, well, actually, so, it's, I'm not fine. It's kind of like, you know, you try being up for nomination every week. So I had one week off and then, it, and then I came back up in have the Have you scene. addressed with people, like, have you ever said to people, what, what's the deal? I mean, obviously you don't know who nominated you. I don't but... know, yeah. Like, I have hunches about people, but I haven't... I don't know what it would be about, so... There's a lot of... There's, there's a handful of people that... <laughs> that I don't think don't, should be here. Yeah, yeah, me too. Me too. And I know, look, I'm not saying everyone thinks the same way as me, not at all, but I'm quite... I know who, who, who's liked, and I, know, I can say someone's a really strong character, even if I dislike them. But there's some people I just don't... I'd be pissed off if I went up before and put it that way. Hmm. Hmm. I, I often wonder whether anyone else sees it the way I do. Because I don't say anything, so I don't know if people do. You I know? think I do. Yeah. And I think Katie does, and I think Danny does. Yeah, that's it. And I think to an extent Ash does. There is a sort of nucleus of uh, the younger, cooler people, generally. Younger, cooler people? Yeah, that's like, I reckon that they will be the ones that are left. E.G.? Like Danny, yourself, Katie. Um, Gales. Ash. Ash. For this, I reckon his big brother, John, Jamie, to the diary room. John. Jamie. Big brother. Rilla. The most fundamental rule of Big Brother is that nominations remain secret. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A short time ago, you both had a discussion about nominations. Yeah. Jamie. Mm hmm. You said, I think that there's a nucleus of the younger, cooler people. <laughs> Generally, I reckon that we will be the ones that are left. I, 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 yeah. This sort of discussion is not permitted. You both know this. Failure to observe these rules can result in penalties, strikes and even early eviction. Big Brother is fining you both $5,000. John, Jamie, mm -hmm. go to the punishment room. Look at Katie. I think that um, it's 
to the point. This is this is what bites me. Um, in here, this is Big Brother, John, Jamie. You are to chop and dice the onions until further notice. There is to be no talking oh, in the damn punishment it. room. Oh yeah. Oh man. Oh, oh man. Coming up, an expensive day for Jamie. Jamie, that's a five thousand dollar fine. Jamie, that's another five thousand dollar fine. To evict Danielle, SMS Danielle to 199 evict. To save Danielle, SMS Danielle to 199 to save. Or call 1902 555577 and follow the prompts. Finished. Jamie and John are in the punishment room cutting onions after being fined for speaking about nominations. <laughs> Is that the... Whoa. Oh. Super bloodshot. Oh, that looks sick, man. Look at... Uh. <laughs> this is Big Brother. John. Jamie. You are to stand in the punishment room until further notice. There is no talking. This is going to be an awesome voice. Got Jamie, it! you just spoke. That's a $5,000 fine. Oh. 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 This is Big Brother. Oh, John, <laughs> Jamie. There is to be silence in the punishment room. Jamie, you just spoke. That's another five thousand dollar fine. Come bird watching with me. Okay. I'm, going to, I'm taking you on a tour. Hi, and welcome to the um, mm. Big Brother National Park. Why am I holding your hand? I'm your guide, <laughs> not your partner. <laughs> Right, we're just going to go for a stroll. You know, it's the habitat and the environment. So I'm getting there. I'm just going to introduce you to the land. Now, before I continue, just above you, we have one of our native species. This is known as the sacred black crow, and they are found in all areas of Australia. So it isn't that exciting, but you can watch it fly over your head. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity. Now, if we head on over to this side of the garden, who knows, we have a Alumbia colonopus species of tree. Now, it is said if you do kiss and embrace this tree, luck will be on your side. <laughs> embrace. You have to have meaning. And the, the tree will fill your wishes and your wants, and they will be fulfilled. <laughs> <laughs> Movie. Two words. <clears throat> First word. Two words. Second word. Biodome! <laughs> oh, oh, go on. Maybe. Katie doesn't cotton on that the boys are not allowed to speak. <laughs> <laughs> what do you call that bird over there? That one there? Would you believe it's called a drop duck? A <laughs> drop duck? You do? Would you believe now? Now you can see that position he's in yeah, now. He's sleeping, that's is actually he? no. Oh no, see that's the effect he wants. That is actually his attack position. He makes out he's sleeping and as we will approach him very quietly now, if you do this at home, you approach with great caution, but you let the animal know you're there. Hello! Hello! Now, if we just Don't freeze be afraid. Here, See how his eyes are open. That tail is up. He's, those wings he's are ready in. to go. You're so right. We'll, I can we'll see approach, that. Approach this one from behind, letting him know we are hey, here. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> and, and the best way to go about it is you get a leaf <laughs> and, and you just his cover eyes. the eyes and you flip them up. <laughs> oh, <so> you, <laughs> you have to be cautious with these because they are a lot heavier. You, you try, now from behind, ready? Now you got to, just careful, let him know you're there. You cover the eyes and you just a quick flick. Let him know you're there. Oh, 
see, he's in that attack mode. He's, he's very defensive at the moment. Everyone. Wake up. I got one. <laughs> Ready? Okay, movie. He can't talk. Yeah, okay. Movie. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> um. Oh, you can't talk. <laughs> Next, is it all on for Danielle and John? I just wanted to show you that I care, my girl. To evict Camilla, SMS Camilla to 199 evict. To save Camilla, SMS Camilla to 199 to save. Or call 1902 555 and follow the prompts. Housemates up for eviction are Camilla, <laughs> Danielle, and Rob. Oh. As winner of the Friday night games, Katie has three points to take off one of the nominated housemates. I think, I think it's obvious. Not for me. I think there's a fair, a fair option. Fair, yeah. Except me. Oh. Oh, no, I don't know. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, you. I'll tell you afterwards. I think people are going to start nominating me on the basis that I take it well. <laughs> <laughs> she laughs about it afterwards so she can handle it. I'll give her two. What a stupid reward! <laughs> Katie, I think you're thinking... You're, you're pretty smart. And I, I think also you think you're very smart and attractive. <laughs> No, you don't. Don't lie now. You're not up. Why? No. <laughs> Maybe this I'm is Big Brother. Katie to the diary room. <laughs> Katie gave her nomination points to Camilla and Rob, but a few minutes later, she changes her mind. Katie, who do you choose to deduct three points from? Contradict what I just said. Um, Camilla, I'll take Um. Hopefully we'll give her a break. Oh. <laughs> Housemates, the nominees this week are Camilla, Danielle and Rob. Nothing has changed. That is all. I'm so happy. <laughs> Thanks. 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 You are Robbie, mate? Yes, I'll just suck it up. But I would, all I'd like to think is that I'm approachable. So if there's anything, oh, don't done. hesitate. Too easy, mate. I was up for nomination my first week. <sighs> then Garland deducted the points off me. You taste like a ton of bricks, man. It's just like bang. It's all good. It's all good. I'll still split a beer with everyone. Um, uh, it's all just a game. Don't know. Yeah. Oh, it's good. You all right? Yeah, I'm fine, actually. Because I was pretty pissed off when I was in your position. Yeah. But I'm not really. Yeah, you're fine. I knew you'd be fine anyway. I don't even think I had to come for you. I just yeah. wanted to show you that I care, my girl. Thanks. Nah, but you're fine. Like, I, nah, I appreciate that. I really do. Um, I hope you got nothing to worry about. Nah. I, I, I reckon I'll go. But um, I'm not to, really... It's good to prepare yourself for that thinking. Mm. Fair enough, I was worried. I know that I'll be right about <laughs> I'm sure you know that. Oh, no, don't worry, honestly. <laughs> Robbie, how are you tracking, man? Good. People do with shock in different ways. I'm picking an outfit to celebrate. <laughs> oh, good man. Mm. Oh, what are you doing, mate? Mm -hmm. I just deal with things differently to normal people. Fair? Yeah. Yeah. Will that be alright? With the it's white hot. shoes? Should I do these jeans or should I do the darker ones? Darker jeans. And how about the hair? Huh? How about the hair? Hair? Yeah, I'll see what I can do. Jamie gave Rob two points for eviction and Rob thinks he can tell. Jamie gets so emotional. Because he, I reckon, Ken Sarah's can't hold guilt. So he's coming here to reassure safe I'm okay. Well, I, that would be my way of interpreting that. He voted for me. He doesn't like it. Yeah. 
Um, I just don't understand what happened with Katie. She's come out and she's like, like she's done a deal with the devil. Why? Katie's acting as if she's like. What's that? I don't. I don't reckon she took three points off it, any of them. I reckon she she's to. done some sort of trade. What else could she do? She would have had to. I think she might have gone for the person who she thought had the highest votes to like take Camilla or something. Who knows? Yeah. Do you, do you reckon? Yeah, I reckon. She, you know yeah. what? It's I, like if you. I was think. I said to Katie. There's a fair option in there. Mm -hmm. And I think she goes, she goes, I know what you're thinking. And she would have thought that I'm just thinking Daniel. I would but have honest, done that. I was thinking, like, in that scenario, I probably would have gone with Camilla because she's had it every week. Why do you still keep going up? Oh, because I'm irritating. Camilla and David both gave Danielle nomination points for eviction tonight. I hope I, I don't know. I'm not irritating. Am I irritating? You don't irritate me. No. Mm, no. That Look, took a bit of answering. Oh, There's well, something I you can't ask. You can't answer. You can't ask me that kind of question unless you want to hear. You know, like I just. Um, I'd like to hear an honest answer. I th well, I don't think you're irritating on the whole, but obviously, you know, living under each other's feet, there are elements of. I'll tell you what you are. You're a messy little. <laughs> you and Katie, the, between you two. No, I'm That's... dead serious when I say when you live on top of people 24-7, same as me, I know in the outside world most of these people would rather hang out with me in the outside world than probably other people in here because I'm heaps of fun and I love to go out and party. The fact of the matter is you live with me 24-7 and I'm probably the most irritating person in the house. Coming up, the penny drops for Camilla. I understand that I'm difficult to live with. To evict Rob, SMS Rob to 199 evict. To save Rob, SMS Rob to 199 to save. Or call 1902 555578 and follow the prompts. I'm really fine. Like, I understand um, that I'm difficult to live with. At the same time, I'm disappointed with the lack of people that have actually come up to me. If I knew what was wrong, I would definitely modify behaviours. I think you behaviors. do know what's wrong, Camilla. What's that? You put your opinion on everything when it's not always worthy of being put into it. You feel like you have to sort of step into it. But when was the last time I did that? I'll take one. And, and I was that involving was, me. And it was involving me. I was uncomfortable with you two being in that bed and frankly that triad was pissing me off. On the weekend, Camilla told Danielle and John she found their late night hugging disrespectful to Dino. And even though Dino has been evicted, the love triangle is still a hot topic. The way you reacted put me in a bad situation. She was purely homesick and was worrying about certain issues. And I believe I was the one, and you, you were right there, and I believe I was the one who said, I'm not liking the situation, I'm leaving. And can I just say up, that... Um, and you stood up and put me under the block in front of everyone in that room. I can count another... that many housemates who felt the exact same way that I did about the issue, but wouldn't have the balls to come to you and say it to your face. And in two words, just by saying, Say to hey my guys, face? What have I, what have I done? We'll say to either, either of you, just say, hey, this triangle is not cool. Hold on, hold on. What, what, what have I done in this situation to lead anyone? I don't on? think... Or when have, I, when have I actually played with it to an extent where it's got out of hand? I don't think it don't was think I... your responsibility to necessarily curb the behaviour, but I did mention to Danny, because she came to me, mm -hmm. and I said to her, dude, I just don't think it's really cool. You've just got to make your mind up. If you do like one, go with that person. If you like the other person, go with that person. It was what other people were thinking. And what was that? Just that it was inappropriate and disrespectful to Dino, my exact words. Okay, to you. yeah. Um, just, 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 has anyone at all mentioned, and I'm really worried about this. Not you. My name was completely given a clean slate in this whole situation. Oh, well, of course you were involved, but no one thought that you were actually the instigator. OK, good. And I... <sighs> Sometimes I'll do things and I won't realise if... I won't know unless someone says to me, you're upsetting me, or don't do that, Camilla, or... I just think people are avoiding conflict in this house so that they... You can stay under the radar. Why did I get in fights? I wanted no. a heated argument at least. Whenever this sort of stuff starts, when they go, oh, you know, like people avoiding conflict and stuff, and it always gets to me because I'm thinking, I'm one of those people. I'm one of those people that hasn't had an argument yet, and I'm like, should I be looking for one? Like, no. Does anyone, really? want to, anyone want to piss me off, and we'll have we'll have it out. That's what pisses you know, me off. Yes. I feel different energies from people, 
As in, now that they've nominated you, they don't want to look you in the eye? Yes. Mm, interesting. And but, do you think that person... But had, had a bit of a bite. You know, when we're talking in the kitchen, we're actually talking to them. Yeah, who's... Mm. Oh, mm. talking about John. Mm. I just... Not I don't... Look. And I never, never used to get the vibe, yeah. but I've got it now. John continues to be upset about looking bad in the love triangle with Danielle and Dino. One thing she said that upset me is that she said that people... Like, like as if I was an instigator in this whole situation. I think that's the furthest thing. And if I was perceived as an instigator, that's a shot of my personality, man, because I would never ever try to do anything like that to like a mate of mine. But it, it just up, it just it makes me worry, man, that maybe people are thinking that I have done something. I don't reckon the girls have obviously shown how they feel and you're not involved. Because Danny's up for vision. I mean, if they're going to do that, what do they think about me, man? It's definitely going to reflect badly on Danny. I know that she's that sort of person. I don't think anyone um, actually begrudges her for her. And I think that you're so far from being incriminated because of the way she has acted. And yeah, she's, she's made it hard on herself. And I don't think that anyone would be looking to you to, or anyone would be looking at you thinking that you were the instigator or that you had anything to do with it. Now, what it does bother me a bit is I don't think anybody's really said anything to you. About Has anything? anybody nothing addressed any issues with you? No, at no all? issues. No, no. You're anything. perfect, practically. Like no you're... indifference of opinion. No personal clashes. No being too extroverted. But on you and any I issues. are extremely dominant personalities. Like we know that. We've always known that. Yeah, we're just strong people within ourselves. But no one's told you anything. For all you know, you're. Perfect. Oh, well, I know that. No. <laughs> what I mean. Well, I know that. And everybody should cotton on soon. <laughs> That's exactly right. No, but it's true. Like, I don't but know. But it, it was funny to see both intruders go up. Yeah, because it, it's easier. If I went this week, I've done very well. Mm. I've done extremely well. But. And I'm proud of myself, you know, I've stuck by my convictions the whole way through. I yeah. haven't, you know, changed. Um, but I want to be here and, yeah, there are a couple of things within myself that I could probably improve in this house and that might make other people's time a bit easier and stuff. But there's other things about myself that I love that I think get on people's nerves that I refuse to change. Tomorrow on Big Brother, Danielle's Diary Room Dilemma. What's too hard? I'm trying to figure out how I feel. To evict Danielle, SMS Danielle to 199 evict. To save Danielle, SMS Danielle to 199 to save. Or call 1902 555 and follow the prompts. To evict Rob, SMS Rob to 199 evict. To save Rob, SMS Rob to 199 to save. Or call 1902 555 and follow the prompts. To evict Camilla, SMS Camilla to 199 evict. To save Camilla, SMS Camilla to 199 to save. Or call 1902 555 and follow the prompts. Votes cost 55 cents each. Calls from mobiles higher. Voting lines close at 7.45pm Australian Eastern Standard Time this Sunday, the 11th of June. Terms and conditions, bigbrother.3mobile.com.au. Thank God you're here. 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 Expect anything on the season finale. Who's Australia's biggest bull? Find out on the Thank God You're Here season finale, 7.30 Wednesday. Coming up next, brand new Simpsons. This program brought to you from Dreamworld, the home of Big Brother.